Laos will play host to the annual ASEAN Business and Investment Summit, or ABIS, in 2024, while assuming the chairmanship of ASEAN. The primary aim is to elevate regional business and investment integration and foster networking with dialogue partners. The Lao National Chamber of Commerce and Industry, or LNCCI, representing the government of Laos, shared insights regarding the summit and associated meetings scheduled to take place in Vientiane from October 8 to 11 during a media briefing on Friday. Key representatives from ASEAN member states, dialogue partners, and sponsors are set to partake in this pivotal summit. <laughs> Mr. Udes, one of whom president of the LNCCI, highlighted that the ASEAN Business and Investment Summit 2024 will serve as a platform to deliberate and formalize strategies for regional business and investment integration amidst the challenges posed amidst the challenges posed by global economic uncertainties. <laughs> He mentioned preparations for the annual business and investment summit and related meetings have made significant headway with several hundred business delegates already registering with the organizers. The hosting of ABIS coincides with Laos' chairmanship of ASEAN with the summit aligning with the chairmanship's theme of ASEAN, enhancing connectivity and resilience. The discussions will closely mirror the priorities outlined by ASEAN and Laos for the year. Scheduled from October 8 to 11, various discussions, dialogues, and forums will be conducted. Eminent personalities, including the Prime Minister of Laos, Mr. Sonsai Sipandon, representatives from the ASEAN Secretariat, and other notable guests will be participating in different sessions. Distinguished guests, including representatives from the World Economic Forum, are expected to engage in discussions focusing on critical topics such as global economic challenges political tensions, and climate change. ABIS 2024 will initially concentrate on dialogues regarding trade and investments within ASEAN, economic integration, logistical connectivity within the region, digital transformation, and the transition to clean energy sources like solar and wind power. A significant highlight will be a plenary session themed Advancing ASEAN-China Connectivity Through Technology, Exploring New Technological Advancements, can bolster cooperation and integration between ASEAN member states and China. Innovation. However, discussion will revolve around leverage digital infrastructure, emerging technologies, and innovation to bridge gaps, facilitate trade, and promote sustainable development across the region. Additionally, a networking breakfast session featuring the Prime Ministers of Laos, Vietnam, and Cambodia will aim to foster deeper regional cooperation in economic integration. Financing Topics such as logistics infrastructure, connectivity, digitalization of logistics systems, and the digitalization of logistics platforms will be integral components of the summit, enabling Laos to showcase its logistics capabilities and promote ASEAN centrality in logistical linkages. As the current ASEAN chair, Laos remains committed to strengthening the ASEAN economic community and ASEAN's centrality through strategic initiatives focus on economic integration, building resilient connections with partners, promoting sustainability, and enhancing digital transformation. The ABIS 2024 is anticipated to fortify economic bonds, stimulate intra-ASEAN trade and investments, cultivate public-private partnerships to address regional economic hurdles, and generate insights for sustainable development and digital transformation within the bloc. It is poised to underscore the roles of MSMEs, green economy practices, women and youth empowerment, technological innovations, and inclusive growth strategies to enhance food security, health resilience, and combat health threats within ASEAN.